This is part of the Dysart family's 456 acres viewed through a forest opening. They donated 54 acres of old growth forest to the Nature Conservancy in the late 1960s and ownership was eventually transferred to Ohio University. The creamy blossoms of May apple, or Podophyllum peltatum, become apple-like fruits from mid to late May. Eastern box turtles eat the fruits and may play a crucial role in the dispersal of May apple seeds. As this fallen sugar maple, or Acer saccharum, breaks down, a mound will form at the base of the tree and a pit will form where the roots ripped up soil as the tree fell. This pit and mound topography is one characteristic of an old growth forest in Ohio. There are two groups of oak trees in Ohio, red and white. This red oak, Quercus rubra, is in the group of red oaks. Red and white oaks have slightly different life histories. For example, Red oak acorns germinate the spring after they fall, whereas white oaks germinate immediately after falling. A large white oak, or Quercus alba, such as this, is an important tree for a variety of wildlife. Deer, turkeys, squirrels, black bears, and a variety of birds depend on the acorns produced by white oak to fatten up for the winter. The orchid family is characterized by incredible diversity. There are over 25,000 species of orchids worldwide. This showy orchid, Galearis spectabilis grows in rich woods and flowers from May to June. The leaves of sourwood, or Oxydendron arboreum, have an acrid or sour taste, thus the name sourwood. These sour leaves turn a brilliant red in the fall, and older trees such as this one develop deep furrows in the bark that resemble an alligator's scales. This brilliant white flower belongs to white trillium, or trillium grandiflorum. It can take trillium plants a decade or more to mature and produce flowers. They are heavily browsed by deer in the spring and summer. Tulip poplar, or Liriodendron tulipifera, is a common tree in southeast Ohio. The large peach-colored blossoms produced by giants such as this one are difficult to see until they fall to the forest floor in late spring. These yellow flowers belong to the wood poppy, or Styliforum diphyllum, one of few poppies native to Ohio. It is found in rich woods and blooms in late spring and early summer. Fire pink, or Selene virginica, is aptly named. Its deep red blossoms stand out on semi-open forested slopes in late spring and early summer. These young oaks, maples, beeches, and other tree species will grow to take the place of larger trees now decaying on the forest floor. As older trees die, they leave openings in the canopy that enable younger trees to sprout up in their place.